Hello, I'm Michael Diamond. You're watching Muscle Central. Make sure you subscribe and turn on your notifications. Okay, we heard the we all had the term off season bulking. Uh, what it comes down to is uh, in between shows, a bodybuilder will try to put on uh, a lot of weight or will put on a lot of weight and hopes to add more muscle tissue for the, for the next time they step on stage. Now, I've seen it quite often. Guys put on 40, 50 pounds or more during this uh, off-season bulk. And then what happens is they got to diet down, get in shape for contest, uh, get ready to step on stage. And then when, after they finish their contest prep and dieting down, when all is said and done, if they put on five more pounds of muscle tissue, they put on a lot. And quite often, that's really what happens. Uh, most of that weight, a good portion of that weight, is going to be, yes, there's going to be some muscle tissue added, but they're putting on body fat, and the body's holding a lot of fluid. And is it really worth it putting on so much weight? only having to lose most of it and in the long run putting on five or so pounds of muscle tissue there's a lot of stress put on the body putting on that extra weight and it's usually done in a <laughs> relatively short period of time uh they can, you can make the same gains without going to that extreme, without putting on that much uh, extra body weight. Yes, you're going to put on, you want to put on, add muscle tissue, you're going to put on some fat along with it, and there's going to be some water retention, but, you know, you want to try to keep that to a minimum and then do what's needed to do to uh, drop the body fat and remove the water while maintaining as much of that tissue that you put on. So, is this off-season bulking, which is... The norm, is it necessary? Do you need to get to those, to put on that much more weight than you're going to be stepping on stage with, only to lose most of it with, uh, with a, only a smaller amount of actual muscle gain from the weight that was put on. You can do it without the bulking. You can put on that extra muscle tissue, add muscle tissue without that crazy bulking. And in the long run, you're going to do your body better by not making those tremendous jumps up and down, up and down, up and down. Yes, there's going to be some weight gain, but you don't want to put on uh, 40, 50 pounds or more excessive weight during that bulking phase. All right, if uh, you agree or disagree with what I've said, please let me know in the comment section. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please share. By all means, subscribe. Do not forget to hit the notification bell. This way, every time I put up a new video, you'll be notified. Also, if you go to the description box, 
I have some links there. One link is to the Facebook Muscle Central page. Any questions, you can go there, DM me. I'd be happy to answer them. You'll find links to Species Nutrition and Mr. Juice Protein Snacks. Click on both those links. Check out, go to both those websites and check out all the great products. There's also a link to another YouTube channel, uh, Buffy the Iron Slayer. Go there. That's run by Chris Miller. He's my partner on Muscle Talk. Check out his content. Once again, this is Michael Diamond. I'd like to thank you for watching Muscle Central.